okay cancer welcome to the grace of thrones if this is your first time this is not welcome back i appreciate your support so at this time i'm going to be pulling messages for you i'm going to clarify them as well if anything resonates with you it may or may not do like share subscribe i appreciate your support once again let's begin all right i already shuffled so let's get into it Ooh, cancer the lovers oh okay you could be dealing with a Gemini or you could have Gemini in your chart. We have Archangel Raziel. Intimate relationships, carefully weighing your decisions right now. And good health. Clarified by the King of Air, okay? You're very brilliant, impartial, professional, diplomatic. All right, speak your mind with confidence. Seek out professional advice when it comes to, you know, your lovers, the lovers in your life, the relationships between your life. You're being asked to balance things, um, from a mental and emotional state and take uh, both of that into consideration when you do those, all right? All right, so it could, it's probably, we're showing up in obstacles and it's been pretty rough out here. Queen of Water, which is the Queen of Cups. Uh, could have been obstacles and challenges with you, you know, being empathetic at this time or maybe your patience is not as, you know, you don't have as much patience as you usually have or you could have. And you're not as loving as you would usually be. It's been a challenge to allow your heart to be tender. Um, but the only thing that happens is it wants you to realize that relationships that you have, they're developing to a new level. So trust your intuition and, and care for yourself um, as you do care for others. All right? It's been an obstacle balance in that. Like maybe you care too much for others and um, not enough for yourself. So remember to include you, right? Number 10, the will. Okay, so six is about balance, 10 is about completion. All right, so we definitely have the will showing up here, right? So things could have been all up and down. Some of you guys could have said, been like, I've, I'm hearing the word slaughter. You could have felt someone slaughtered. Or you was led to the slaughterhouse. But God, all right? There's a time of positive change here for you, a situation. Uh, when Arch uh, Angel Michael is showing present, where there's going to be suddenly a news for you to move forward, all right? And fortune is on your side, baby. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? After riding off using your brilliant intuition and your God given uh, brilliance and using your mind and standing your confidence and not being afraid of seeking that professional help. That's needed. So some of you guys, I'm here. I'm getting here in therapy, coaching, things of that nature, counseling. Outcome is three of water, which is three of cups. All right, it's gonna work out for you. A celebration, maybe even a wedding for some of you guys, a graduation or some uh, birth of uh, announcement of a birth. All right, there's a need for you to have more fun. So go ahead and shake your tail feather. Um, bottom of it, that we have nine of water. All right, a lot of emotional fulfillment. Nine of Cups is about um, your desires coming true. So you can expect uh, something that you truly desired could be in love, something you love into relationships is you will um, have that luck. It says your wishes come true, right? Uh, concerns that you have with, will fade away, especially around um, your love life because there's a love of, of, you will have the love of your life. All right, you will have the love of your life. Love of my life. You are. Okay, you guys could be friends, all those friends are just really good friends, all right? All right. Pieces, deuces, and anything you hear with me, we should do like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.